No, righty. Um, okay, so now we know that the efficiency is 0 0.071393. Right, that's from the previous problem, right? Okay, and then we know that work is 134. So we're going to do the same thing here, right? We eventually want to find the QH and the QC, right? So let's do this. Uh, this is uh, work over QH, so therefore 0 0.071 is equal to 134 over QH, All right? So 134 divided by uh, hold on, hold on. Okay, let's store that. Okay, there it is. Okay, so 134 divided by that number is 1876. So QH is 1876.91. So this should actually be a 7. All right, there we go. And that's joules. All right, and then I can simply use uh, what QH is QC plus uh, work to figure out the QC, right? So 1876.91 is QC plus 134. So I'm going to subtract 134 and get 1742.91. All right, that's joules, and that's what our QC is. All right. Alternately, by the way, I can just simply multiply. Um, I can just simply multiply this by 1 minus uh, 0 0.071 three nine three eight, right? Because th this proportion is the proportion that's wasted, right? The point, the 7.14 percent is used, and one minus that 93 percent or 92 point something percent is actually not used, right? Um, so I can do it that way too. Anyway, 